Hello everyone, Josh for us back again bring guys some more Seven Daily Sins Grand Cross. Today we're gonna be going over the latest patch news. Uh, the first event here is the spin for limit break materials and more. Um, clear Fort Solgris and get a spin ticket. You can get 30 of those max per day and the roulette gives you these various rewards. Um, you can only reset the, the, the wheel, I guess, six times. So make sure before you reset the wheel, you pick up all the rewards that you want, especially the Water of Life, Demon Bloods, Probably all three books, and of course the SSR treasure chest. Um, I'd actually go for the ale as well, because it's nice and helpful with infinities. But outside of that, I guess you can go in and spin it, unless you're really hurting for uh, ears, wings, and horns, which most of you probably aren't, because you can farm those out throughout the day if you have an active guild, for example. But yeah, definitely get all the rewards that you want before you reset. Um, that way you can maximize on your return. If you guys are farming this entire event, um, every single day you should probably be able to clear out the whole shop though um, All six times so you might not even have to worry about it Just really depends on how impatient or patient you really are, but I'll, you, you get some good rewards here um, The water of life and demons blood is definitely the highlight of that event um, For uh, those of you out there who like to spend money on the game We got the double the diamonds the bogo we get this pretty much every single week so this isn't really newsworthy, so we're just going to go ahead and get rid of that. Uh, we have the roll for that perfect awakened equipment stat. So yes, it's finally come to this. We now have anvil packs. 150 anvils, 5 star awakening stones times 5, and 500,000 gold. I have no idea what the price margin is on this at this time. I'm thinking it's going to be maybe $23.99 tops. If it's any more, if it's more expensive ugh, if it's more expensive than that then it's not worth it and honestly i would rather this be more around 10 15 bucks um because i cannot price out anvils the same way i do diamonds because diamonds can be used for stamina they can be used for main stats they can be used for sub stats they can be used for summoning they can be used for buying um costume items so diamonds have a lot more value than anvils do so you can't compare five anvils and two diamonds to try and get the justification for prices so i don't know what the price is going to be but if it's more than 24 dollars, i don't feel that it's really that worth um i'd like to see it around 10 15 though i think they'd sell a lot more of these if they did that and it'd help a lot of you out with gear but i know this is going to start the uproar of free to plays versus whales because of how much this will benefit whales obviously on gear so we'll see how this goes what do you guys think about this pack let me know in the comment section below all right story event story event bartra's test uh get water of life need some water of life materials here's your chance i wonder why we need a lot of water of life <clears throat> Eskinor next week <laughs> um bartra's test uh period 421 to 427 so it's gonna be here for a week get rewards by clearing the story event uh there's a normal hard hard in hell difficulty i believe this is the first hell difficulty of any type of stage in the game on global so far unless i'm incorrect but i think that is i could i could be mistaken if so you can let me know in the comment section below but you can pick up three four star waters of life and four five star waters of life so very very nice and it looks like you can participate five times per day i'm wondering on hell mode what the actual drops are going to be i mean i want to see what the drops are for all the stages but hell in particular is what i'm really interested in so we're gonna have to see what the actual drops for the stage actually are gonna be just you know the normal drops not the uh, special rewards so there's that we now have the rank up bundle five so if you guys are trying to get from rank 60 to 70 on your account which is now going to be a thing on global to get up to rank 70 that'll have more stamina which would be nice uh be able to open up for more friends as well so that'll give you more friend points per day um, you can go in and pick up this uh, this pack. It looks like it's gonna be the same as the rank up four So it might be around forty dollars for 250 um, Give or take so for those of you again that are spending and looking for a really good value. This is definitely gonna be it um, And then we have our April week four event schedule. We're getting free stage stamina on um, 20, 423 to 24 uh, Fort Solgris stamina decrease on 425 to 426. So your book farming uh, we also get uh, gold reward increase as well, so that's going to be really good. If you guys are really low on gold, 425 to 426, Fort Solgris is going to be the way to go because you're literally going to get double the gold and half stamina. Very, very nice. Um, 
And that's pretty much it. Well, equipment salvage up. We're getting this from 421 to 428. So it's going to be for the entire week, as well as the hero enhance up. Uh, they increase the chance for a super success and an ultra success for both those. So if you guys have been stocking up on your gear keys that you've been getting from the daily rewards and stuff like that uh, for the past few days, you can go ahead and go to the gear gacha, get all that gear, and then salvage it up. Um, make sure that you plus one your SSRs at least um, and get as much value back as you can for the, for the next week. So that's nice. And that's pretty much it, guys. Now, we do have a new banner, but I'm going to be saving that for the next video for should you summon or should you skip. Spoiler alert, it's not very good. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for my update video. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Till next time, don't forget to subscribe, tick notifications, and like the video if you did. If you guys want to play this, uh, play Grand Cross on PC, the link is in the description below. If you guys want to join us in the description below at our Discord link, go ahead and do so as well. Um, we have an upcoming tournament, com tournament coming this weekend. Um, I'll have more information about that and our participants for the first ever Grand Verse Championships. Uh, later this week, so I hope you guys are excited for that. We're gonna try and post videos and stuff like that of matches um, And maybe even with our first inaugural champion get a one-on-one -on -one interview and upload that to YouTube and all kinds of other cool stuff coming your way So I hope you guys are excited for that and uh, that's pretty much it So again, don't forget to don't forget to subscribe take notifications again um, And comment below what you guys think about all this week's events. I know it's not very good. It's very lackluster There's no Escanor um, Which I'm gonna um, I'm going to talk more about that probably in another video, but that's it. So, take care. Have an awesome one. Until then, peace.